डिक्टेशन स्टार्ट आफ्टर थ्री सेकेंड रेडी स्टार्ट इट इज़ टोटली कंट्राडिक्टरी टू दी स्प्रिट ऑफ दी सचार कमेटी विच हैड अ वेरी सोशलिस्ट अप्रोच इट इज कॉन्ट्रेरी इफ आई मे सबमिट विथ योर परमिशन टू दी थिंकिंग ऑफ दियर ओन प्राइम मिनिस्टर आई डू नॉट अंडरस्टैंड हु इज दी ऑथर ऑफ दिस बिल I do not understand how this kind of omnibus bill without direction has been brought. This is one of the most poorly drafted pieces of legislation that I have come across. I submit that apart from these things if the honorable minister may allow me to submit I have seen in the administration of companies for smaller things they are more particular if a company is not filing some paper on time promptly they will send a notice but there are some other companies which i know of which are not repaying their depositors depositors are knocking at their doors and nobody is listening to them stop para this kind of anomaly must be corrected since this is a very important act in the sense that the entire corporate sector is administered by this act if the government has any power to discipline companies it is through this act and if this act is treated in such a callous manner i am at my wits end to understand how larger companies will ever come within the framework of any discipline at all they will not what whenever any controversy starts we start the controversy of the public sector and the private sector this is a needless controversy in this country we need the private sector and we need the public sector in this country we need large companies and we need small companies everybody must play his role as per the scheme of the constitution as per the scheme of various resolutions we in the opposition may or may not agree with the government's policies but just now the government policies must adhere at least to what their own avowed objectives are this bill does not even conform to their own pattern it is strange to me i do not understand how these provisions have found their way into this bill especially in relation to the entire corporate deposits and loan just because a few high court judgments have clearly stated that a loan is different from a deposit the reason you are giving is that this bill also include the provision to plug loopholes and remove some lacuna this is not a loophole or a lacuna loans and deposits are two different things but by an act of parliament we are trying to change the context and the meaning of the entire corporate operations and functions stop